Hi, I'm Renee Bryant with the Johnson County Department of Health and Environment. I am the Healthy Food Policy Coordinator and I work with the community um, on helping them in ways to increase access to healthier foods. Today during Public Health Week we're going to focus on um, eating healthy foods at the workplace. Most of us consume about two-thirds of our calorie intake at the workplace, so today we'd like to offer you some helpful hints on how to do that. Often we find ourselves heading to the vending machines, which are often filled with unhealthy snacks and a lot of calorie-dense foods. So what we can do is plan ahead. Um, bring your lunch, pack healthy snacks, and try to avoid the vending machines, which are mostly candy bars and unhealthy food. If your workplace offers a cafeteria, one of the most important things is to navigate it before you go in. You're going to be hungry, so you want to take a look at places that offer healthy fruits and vegetables. You've got the entree line, most likely a grill, and a salad bar. Choose your whole wheat breads, um, keep your low lower fat dressings on your salad, try to avoid a lot of the toppers. When you go to your entree line, choose your grilled foods and a lot of vegetables. If you happen to be the one that are planning the work meeting or the work functions, there's a few things you can focus on. The first is drinks. You want to offer water, coffee, teas, and avoid your sugary beverages like sodas. The other is portion control. Make sure that all portions are a single serving. A lot of times all we need to do is cut your muffins, bagels, and desserts in half. And the other is always offer a healthy fruit and vegetable as easy as offering a platter. What we always want to do is make the healthy choice the easy choice for our employees. So during Public Health Week, we encourage you to make healthier choices at the work site through your cafeterias, your vending machines, and also choosing healthy choices at your meetings and work functions.